with protests happening right now in Northeast Kansas. Thanks for joining us. Protesters have been gathering since about 8 o'clock in Topeka asking for racial equality and police reform. KSNG News reporter Hannah Brandt is live at the protest now and joins us with what's happening. Hannah. Yeah, actually the protests just wrapping up here. You can still see protesters as they're getting into their cars. About 100 protesters made their way earlier tonight from the Capitol building to the Brown versus Board Museum. It's about a mile walk. I looked it up, so kind of a long walk. And that's where they stood as they listened to people speak about their experiences, about the Black Lives Matter movement, and about the changes they wanted to see in this community. Now, what made this protest a bit different from the ones that we've been at in Topeka in the past is that this time several speakers had calls to abolish and defund the police department, though not everyone agreed on that. One of the last people we heard from was an 82 year old man from Lawrence, and he spoke about his experience as a black man with a son who's a police officer. He said he did not want to see police departments abolished, but he said he did want to see change towards racial equality. And there were several other passionate speakers who spoke about their experiences. Here's what one woman said about the experience of being a black woman in our community. The black women in America, we should have to wake up and wonder, is my dad okay? Is my brother alive? Is my son going to wake up? Do I know where he is? Now, several people from the Topeka Police Department were here, marched with protesters tonight, and we even caught up with a few of them after the protest had kind of wrapped up, having conversations with protesters, even with a protester who was adamant in her support to defund the police department. I witnessed a police officer offer to give her his cell phone number, and he seemed really open to having discussions about what she wanted to see change. So definitely some productive conversations happening here tonight as well. Live from downtown Topeka, Hannah Brandt, KSNT News.